The first time I saw a book that looked like me, it actually just more felt like me. The book is called A Wonderful Terrible Time, and it's by an author named Mary Stoltz. The book came out in 1967, and it's about these two young black girls and how they spend their summer. And it's super simple, and I saw myself so much in the character Mady, who just wanted to be left alone and read all day. And it was one of the first times that I can honestly say, like, this is me. The age was me. The look was me. It just felt like I could really, um, I could really connect to the character. Now, I'm happy to say that when I think about where were the books that looked like me, in my world, it was all of them. My parents were very, 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 very um, about making sure that my books and my toys and my television shows and all of that looked like me. So much so that sometimes I didn't want it. Sometimes I didn't want the black doll. Sometimes I didn't want to have to watch the black show. Um, but now I so much appreciate what they were trying to do. And Mary Stoltz's book did that quite a bit. It's written during the civil rights era. And for the kids, it's kind of like just this backdrop. You know, they know this is happening, but it doesn't really feel real to them, which is a lot different than I think kids today. I think that a lot of them, they know what's going on and they know it well. It's right in front of them. Um, but yeah, I loved A Wonderful Terrible Time. It's Mary Stoltz, Harper and Row, 1967. And every once in a while I revisit it and just doing this to let people know about this book is making me want to revisit it again. So that's what I'm gonna do. My name is Aaliyah King Neal. I'm the author of Keep Your Head Up. And the book that made me feel like me was A Wonderful, Terrible Time by Mary Stoltz. Mm -hmm.